in the van again. This time we're down at gonna be pitching here. Paid 20 pound. I could maybe get over a bit. Paid 20 quid to park there. So you go in the car park here, is pain display all day, but you've got to come through, through down here into this area for the camper vans. And it's 20 pound at the machine or pay the harbour master if you can find them. See, it's here, there he is, it's not here. So that is very handy, very handy. 20 pound, but it's a nice place. No. Don't do it. This time, I'm not alone on this channel, making her debut <laughs> on this channel. Shy. Yes, because uh, yeah, this is a posh channel. This is the posh channel. I'll have to be on my best behaviour. Yeah, this is an old harbour town, um, and you still get the deep sea divers going out, fishing boats who do the uh, fishing, collecting lobster pots and what have you. Lifeboat over there. All the lobster pots over there. Aye, there's millions, isn't there? But there's no, there's no pubs or restaurants, so you've got to go into uh, up into Callingham. So there's a little cafe there, which Aye. is called the Ebb Car, which do the best crab sandwiches. Crab sandwiches. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, anyway, we're stopping here tonight. Emma's in her car. Yeah, I am. And I look, am. look who else is here. I'm in my car because the dog's here. He's like, oh God, not you with that bloody camera again. So we're going to have a wander along the course lane up find a pub and then just much about so we'll be coming back we might show them the church it's colder than bay possibly so you can walk along the cliff top from St Abbs there just climb up the hill it brings you out here look at this Is that, is that Coldingham Bay down there then? The beach area, the beach. I'm sure um, Julie and Sinclair camped there. Yeah, Julie did the coastal, the same one I did the coastal path. She did that. Aye. Uh, well. I recognise it now. Hi. Hello. Hello there. Hi. See, Julie got a mention. Bet she doesn't watch these. Oh, yeah. So there we are. Beautiful Coldingham Bay. It is nice, like. They're all in, they've got wetsuits on, everything. Part timers. Little chalets there. The mint on one of them, wouldn't it? Wait, let me get a selfie. Well, you have to get the beach in the back Any... Back, further back, further back. <laughs> Do you know this is a video? Sorry, is it? Yeah. It's good to have it in isn't it? We've happened upon... What's this place called? This, I don't know. Oh, the Coldingham. 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 And look, antique shop. Antiques. Get my dog now. Love an antique shop, me. Always plan to buy something you never do, do you? Anyway, so we're going to go into this 
pub here and have a drink because we're sweating. It's forecast rain, thunderstorms today. And look at it. Blue sky and 20 odd degrees. So we're going in. We're going in. We're going in. Coldingham Priory, right? So pause it there and have a look at it. Read that. The old hearse house, right? This building was constructed in the 1850s to provide accommodation for the hearse. Ooh, following the Victorian restoration. Ooh. Lowry's in the small window to the left for the building at another occasion. This is a mortuary. Oh my god. It's the house of death, literally. I was saying last week in Rothbury, like, wow, the graves are so close together. Somebody told us in one of the comments, which I haven't replied to, which I will, that the, um, oh, I can't remember what he said. Something about. Heart rate 105. <laughs> that's what he said. <laughs> Heart rate 105. <laughs> <coughs> We're in the graveyard again. I told you I love graveyards. We love a graveyard. I love the graveyards. Not On a graveyard trip. <laughs> no? Mm -hmm. No? You did? You have? We went to. Uh, we went up the hill. Up the hill, yeah. And I made you the best sandwich you've ever had in your life. Having a wee. What a bugger. This is the oldest bit. This is like 11th century, this. This arch. It's all that's left in the original priory. 11th century Neolithic. Something like that. I think it was the, the Japanese built it in the Bronze Age. The great, the great Emperor Yamamoto came over here. Look, and this is where he's buried, look. This is Adrian who? This is Yamamoto. Adrian's wall. Alright, that's it, you can tell. This is the memento mori, which means that you've got to remember that as there is life, there is also death. It's where they put the village idiots, law. Get yourself in. <laughs> in the stocks. Hi, you under there. That's Thomas the tank engine. <laughs> There's the fat controller with his little curly quiff. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost the tank engine. Why, why is it like that? <laughs> Emperor Yamamoto had a real good sense of humour. Oh, what's that yeah. step? See, when I'm filming, I don't watch where I'm walking. This is lovely. Is this Camphor? Nah. Nah, it's not. Oh, there's somebody strimming. Walking over graves and everything, yeah. What have we found? We have happened upon part of Adrian's wall. Oh, yeah. Did you know it came all the way from St. Arbs along to Coldingham? Yeah. People think it goes from Wall's End, but it doesn't actually. It comes from St. Arbs. This is the far eastern turret of Hadrian's wall. Mm -hmm. And Emma there said it first, just before I was about to say it, so yeah. it must be true. It is true. Like absolutely true. Uh, you can tell it's a bit, bit of the same the stuff. Stand and watch on duty. All going to the church for the all mead. Because yeah. isn't this where listen. isn't this where they make the mead? Yeah. If you listen, you can hear the sound of the Neolithic strummer. Oh, you're just being daft now. You're just making things up now. <laughs> it's my facts are real. <laughs> yeah. Go on, go on. Uh, it's always a little one. Yeah. 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 So we will partake of some refreshment and then we'll continue back and I think we'll end up on the beach we'll, we'll end up on the beach whether we're going in or not it's a different matter like we will we are one, going in the same one of us might be going in we are going in the same and they don't go near us I've got a big sense of dinner still here I think we've been here two and a half hours or so. I think we've 
got heat stroke. That's what I'm saying it is. Probably true. Heat stroke, we've been sat in the blazing sun. It's beautiful. It is beautiful. And it's the blazing sun. Just to prove it. And we're going in the sea. Come on. Yep. We're going to go down the beach. I'm going in the sea. Andy's coming in as well. <clears throat> We're going to have to walk back down, set the um, Strava back off. I think we'll probably do about three and a half, four mile by the time we get back. It's not loads, but you know, ah, it's all right, In the man. grand scheme of what we normally do. Yeah, but we've had a good good day though, haven't we? Lovely. Day drinking. I'm not a, I'm not a drinker and I'm, I'm not, not a day drinker. I'm not. This is marvellous. Get used to it. Mm -hmm. You better get used to it. Well, cheers. Oh, cheers. Oh, cheers, aye. To the regiment we're showing here. Oh, cheers. Oh, oh. You have to say that. Right. Do you want any salt and pepper and stuff? Aye, right, look, things for your van. When you come to these places, right, you get things for your van. If you're in the van life, if this, this is actually a van life channel. We'll be having this tonight. We'll be eating so, these tonight. Vinegar. We should pinch these. Sour cream. Salt and pepper as well. I've got salt and pepper and a bloody shake, am I? But yeah, them sashes are good. Foxy's roasting. Yeah, we need to get him in the sea. Will not be long. <laughs> Look at them side eye in here. Right, so we'll finish these and then we're off. Boosh. Boosh. Ah, that's it. Look, we've been in the pub. Right, I've just stolen Andy Vogel's. I've just stolen Andy Vogel's GoPro. And now I'm outside and he's going to go mad because I'm recording stuff and he can't okay it. Well, he can because he can edit this. Oh, here he comes. <laughs> he's away. <laughs> Here he comes, look, here he comes, here he comes. Right, I'm going now. Too many beers. I'm going home for a sleep. It's carnage. down on Callingham Beach which is really nice it looks quite safe dogs gone wild no the best time the, um, the mist has come in the sea fog called sea fret and some places called sea ha they call it the ha in Scotland I don't know why, but yeah, so we're not going in the water this time, it's turned a little bit chilly, but we will get in one point. He's loving it, he's loving it. <laughs> That's cruelty. Missed it. That's animal cruelty. That's it. And there's the sea fret ruining everything. We're hoping it's going to pass, but it probably won't. That's all right. Still warm. It's not cold. Not raining. The main thing.
We haven't got any change of gear or anything. This is going to go wrong, this. Ah, <laughs> oh. oh, I can't believe she's in. He's got more sense. She's gone in. She's going in. She's in. Oh, no way. No. Miss Wet T-shirt contest. Back in. <laughs> Look at him swimming. <laughs> Was that good? Oh. Was that good? Oh. Oh, I haven't got a change of clothes, that's a problem. So? Are you in the Miss Wet t shirt contest now? Yeah. I'm not gonna. Nearly, I didn't get right under because I didn't want to get salty hair. I'll not pan down. I should have took my pants off. So after that, we've got the, um, the fog bank, is, it's gone over there. It's moved. So we're back in the nice blue sky. A strange rock over there. How does it get like that? But these are rugged, rugged rocks, these. Oh, I'll definitely come back here and do a bit of paddling. A bit of paddling. But look at that fog bank. See how it's gone over that way, though? Yeah. So we're laughing here. Right, we're going to go upstairs now, of Terra, up to the top, and then back down. Ooh. Stairs of doom. This looks like bamboo. I think it is. Can it be? Sea bamboo. Right, well, we're back at the harbour. We've done 3.7 miles, which is all right. That's a good walk, but unfortunately, the mist's come back. It's rolled in again. Mist rolling in from the sea. Hey, we could make a song about that. Mist rolling in from the sea. How can we fit that into a song? <laughs> uh, so anyway, this is St. Abbs Harbour. Nice harbour. Lots of piers, so they must get a lot of rough sea. That's why they do it. They've got the built that piers into the natural basalt cliffs, the rocks. Really hard, tough. Hardware and rocks. Ooh, there's loads of little seats where I can just have a break. But yeah, this is it. So we probably won't do much more filming. Well, we might. I don't know. Depends how we feel. Might go for a wander around the harbour. Just gotta get myself sorted out. Em's just gotta get herself dried off. She brought spare clothes. I didn't. She's obviously done this before, and uh, that's it. So this is Ebb Cars. Light lunches, home bacon, teas, coffees, rice. Licensed. There's the menu, if you want to pause the menu. Mm, not bad. That's not bad at all. Cheeseburger, 4 95 I love that. But yeah, everybody's gone. Everybody's away. Good.
<clears throat> so this is the view we'll have out the back. Just uh, beer on. Oh yes. Clothes drying there from earlier's episode. Dry, we're parked up on the harbour front. We've got a couple here from Derby who are having a great time doing the North Coast 500. I can't believe I'm so jealous of them. Like, are you, you jealous? Are no, because this is a nice van. I'm not jealous at all. I'm happy. Isn't it a nice van? You're just, you're just envious of everything. Isn't it? And then, Cut that out. Cut that out. Yeah. I've got beer. I'm alright. Right, so what I'm going to do is watch behind you, right? Oh yes, I have lights. And if I press this button here, they go green. That's marvellous. They go red, purple, and they go red, oh, and then orange, and then yellow, and then marvellous. back to uh, back around to blue. So they were cheap on Amazon. I mean, there, there's more of them down there, but I can't. Hey, they do the job. I've got anywhere to put them ones. I have to find somewhere It's like them. a landing strip. You just want to see when you get out to go for a pee. That's it. Don't you? Yeah. So yeah, here we are. Look, chilled in the van. Loads of space. Loads of space in this van. We've got all the room in the world. So we're going to just chill out, enjoy the beers, enjoy the view and the sound of the sea. I will leave you listening to the sound of the sea. This is the sound of sound.